I'm very happy today. I've just arrived at Creswick Hammond Park and the mountain bike hub has just opened. And um, so I'm just gonna have a quick cruise around and see what there is. All right, so they've extended the car park and over there is the old pump track. Let's have a look. kids play area in there bit of a road <laughs> old footy sand oh there's a bridge here now I'll go across to the path on the other side used to have to go out on the road over there and go do a big loop to get around so now this is really really good constructed bridge and it actually looks flood proof had a lot of um, floods in Creswick if, you, if the flood knocks down this bridge, I'll be very surprised. Really humpy, jumpy things, I guess. <laughs> so obviously the jump track just there, bitumen. It lasts forever. It's a little bit wet, oh, a bit of berm practice. <laughs> Probably a bit soft to be doing that. No little pump there. Then we have a skills log to ride up on. Ooh. I might not ride that today, it's a bit wet. I love when they include a drink for a dog. I have some old berms here. Very long jump. <laughs> not sure what this is. This is just Little practice area. It's kind of like well, it is um compacted kind of bitumen. Nice barbecue area. Let's have a bit of fun. Really good way to warm up. It's slow on the nobbies. <laughs> so this this pump track's been here for a couple of years. Well, there's a new um, jump track over there, which I'll go. Okay, let's go and look at the jump track. Oh, they're big. Okay, let's do a little ones first. Yeah, need a lot more speed. No more idle. No more idle. Huh? You did tours of open car and king of Ballarat. That's me. Yeah. <laughs> I always watch your videos. Oh, thanks, man. <laughs> Alright. Please don't crash. Yeah. Oh, what? What? Oh, stop you. Stop this one. <laughs> <laughs> These kids are fast. <laughs> <Woo. Look how cool this is. This is just the um, bike wash. <laughs> how cool is that? I guess you push that and pull that. Oh yeah, you hold your bike up. Then you got this spray. How cool is this? <laughs> and over here we have a the usual cool bike um, 
tool station with all the tools you need. We've even got like these e-bike chargers. Doesn't look like they're hooked up yet. But that's cool. It's like a good place to come with a barbecue and just hang around and ride around. A little practice on the berms and try out this little skill track. You've also got the option of the of the jump track and the pump track. You might be wondering why I've changed my top. It's because it's the next day. Well actually it's a few more days the next day and I've come back because there's a few things I wanted to mention um, that I didn't know myself and I kind of ran out of time on the day. So here we are back um, and this is what we're all waiting for. This to open. A bit muggy and muddy. The track's heading off up that way. So I'm guessing this is the main trailhead. I think this is where it will start. But it's not open. It's uh, 13th of May 2023. As you can see, it looks like there's still a little bit of construction left. It hasn't all been done yet. So it looks like a fair bit, possibly more work being done. I'm not sure if there's going to be more skills tracks here or not. I was hoping for a little bit more to be honest I and mean, I'm very grateful of what we've got. It's all looking a little bit flat and plain but I'm sure once it grows it'll be amazing. Now I want to head out and just try and see what's happening with the trails out there. I saw some construction a little bit a while ago and um, I want to see where they are with it. So let's go and have a look. Like a lot of um, riders I'm not really sure what's going on and how long until these parts open but it's going to be cool. See that there so it's even started growing over a bit since they started building it i don't know why oh my god there's a huge pig over there <laughs> i don't know if you can see that <laughs> but when this opens it's going to be so so good because i know a lot of the trails i know all the trails out here except for these new ones um and it's not marked so unless you're a local or riding with someone it's it is a little hard finding a way around and there is all those trails i know of are actually just bush trails they're part of the great dividing trail and they're still open but this trail here which is under construction um i have no what a idea what it's called or or what it's going to be it looks like a flow trail i'm don't know if, even which way it goes like that section I showed you so here's a little se section here right. and there is a tire mark someone's been riding it yeah so unfortunately this part's still closed and it doesn't look like they've done anything for a while and it's winter approaching winter so this is the bit that's going to join up with the track that's closed. As you can see it's pretty slippery and sparse. Oh, there's a slidey tree down there. This will be all nicely worn I imagine soon. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, it's going to be awesome. Oh. Yeah. oh, hang on, I missed it. <laughs> so, the actual track is just the. Oh, God, I want to do it, but I don't want to do it. I'll sort of go around the idea, the outskirts, give you an idea. It runs up there, through there, some cool little twisties there. It looks like they're going to make it a bit more flowy, maybe put more berms through here, down here, so this bit's open. I'm riding in a section that isn't taped off, so don't yell at me, I'll show you. And this, this is where it comes to those rocks. I was just talking about these rocks thinking that you actually came down here, but looks like you're actually right up here. 
can you imagine coming up here and then taking a sharp left this is going to get worn power up here and you've cut all that corner out or possibly this one which is a bit steeper but shorter straight up there it'd be interesting to see which one's quicker or the easy route around there I'm looking forward to trying e-bikes will probably have no problem this is such an exciting thing for Creswick they've been waiting so long years and years COVID and red tape and yeah I'm not going to go into that politics of it all but it's good to see one day this will be fully open and functional and let's pray the trails open soon thanks for watching guys hope you enjoyed and i'll catch you next ride